This week, the abrupt firing and later rehiring of OpenAI CEO Sam Altman grabbed headlines. It also raised questions about who's in charge of this new artificial intelligence technology. As CBS's Charlie DeMar shows us, AI has made breakthroughs of its own. At first glance, it may look like a small toy or gadget, but Sam Kriegman, a Northwestern University professor, sees the future. The goal of this robot is incredibly simple. It's just to make the robot move forward. And what does that show you? So movement is fundamental to intelligence. It's why animals have brains and plants do not. So what are we looking at here? The wiggling chunk of purple silicone is the product of a simple command to a computer. Make a robot that can move across a flat surface. Building on decades of research into artificial intelligence, it only took the program seconds to design the complex series of chambers and connections that make it move when air is pumped in. So basically it's like sketching out the shape of the molds. Kriegman and his team say this is the first time AI has built a robot, but what it can do isn't the main point, it's what it could mean. You refer to this as, as instant evolution. Uh, what do you mean by that? It's going to provide a whole new window into biological evolution because now we can watch evolution unfold before our eyes. For all that promise, Gary Marcus, a leading voice on artificial intelligence, says right now AI is about as developed and understood as a temperamental teenager. There are very few checks and balances right now, but it throws its weight around. It doesn't really have you know, firm values yet, and that's a problem. Giving AI human values and a conscience are just two of the challenges facing the technology, but Marcus says he's mostly optimistic. Greatest hope is that we revolutionize science. My greatest fear is that democracy falls because there's so much misinformation and we never get to my greatest hope. Kriegman says he hopes that like his robot, AI learns to walk first, then it can run. And this kind of AI tool and others like it will help us speed design and come up with completely new ideas. Charlie DeMar, CBS News, Evanston, Illinois.